There. You killed her. Are you happy now? Can you leave me now? <laughs> no, of course not. Actually, something which I would have been more uh, appropriate, perhaps, would it be if um, uh, if he actually killed off Ellen, you would get a game over. Yeah, that would be great. Mm. Yeah, I mean, uh, <laughs> at this point, it's a little bit too late. I probably would have won. I probably should have gone for the uh, the lab the laboratory with uh, Nate instead. But it's a bit, yeah. And uh, I, yeah, I don't think it's too likely that I will um, play this game a second time just to just to see um, what the what if I take the Nate route, what that's like. Um, I think the only difference is that, um, you, yeah, I I don't think the the, the choice you make back there is actually makes too much of an impact on the game in itself, um, I think. Hmm. Oh, oh wait, did I, um, I think I screwed up the, the fusion. <laughs> Didn't want to do that. Okay, um. Oh, and now he starts doing that again. Maybe I should have gotten better weapons for for people. Um, if you're watching and you haven't played Innocent Sin, um, you you might have noticed in this in this game that I don't haven't really um, bought new weapons. Well, well, then again, yeah, I probably would have done that off screen, but still. Um, uh, I haven't bought, new, bought bought any new weapons because um, it doesn't feel like I, I'm using them too much. But uh, it, they actually do become... Um, they're not a bad thing to invest in in Innocent Sin, it's, uh, at least from mid to late game. Mostly because um, skills... Skills consume more SP, and uh, even though you regenerate uh, SP when you're running or walking around, uh, it's it's never enough to com get you completely back up to full again before you have to enter another fight. Um, so sometimes you some you can't just yeah at the end of the game you can't just spam the skills as much as you want so. Sometimes it's not a bad deal to actually use your weapons, especially if they're fairly good. Because um, just doing damage with your weapons can sometimes be an okay, an okay amount of damage compared to what skills can output. So, um, um, and we'll have to see if that that will be the same in this game as well. Uh, if I have to invest in weapons later on, um, I I most I try to not use them mostly because I want to um, use my persona skills to rank them up or have them rank up. Um, so that's why. And weapons do nothing except for doing damage. Oh, there we go.
His neck is broken. It would be impossible for him to move. Yes, please say he's dead now. I want... I'm the same. I don't want to fight this guy anymore. Miss Amano, doesn't it seem strange? Though we had no idea where to go, why did he always show up where we did before us? This could be what that cat meant by the terror of the Kimon Tonko. Yeah, yeah, a terror, all right. Um, yeah. So, hopefully this should actually be the last time I have to fight this guy. switch back my personas yes uh, I yeah I don't know why I but I think I've actually gotten it right before uh, there is the distinction between um, persona and Shin Megami Tensei there's several but basic but you, yeah you don't really call uh, the demons in the persona games demons they're personas because they are Personas and in demons it's different because you recruit the demons um, And that's it. They're not any they're not some kind of uh, uh, Persona of your own personality like, as in these games like um, So yeah, but yeah, basically the distinction is that you don't call the um, Demons in this game are uh, demons, they are personas. And I think I've been saying that correctly before. I don't know. But the, the, the thought kind of struck me before when I... Um, uh, when I was thinking back to some things I've been, I, I said uh, during one of my Nocturne videos. And I thought, yeah, I, <laughs> I know that some people they, some people want to get the facts straight so that um, so that um, the the uploader or the let's player does not give out incorrect facts, which I can actually understand since I watch uh, LPs myself. But really, sometimes it's just um, sometimes you might just say things incorrectly because you you can it's a it can be tricky to just think what you. Think of what you're saying by, while you're playing at the same time, and uh, so that's how it is. And you're 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 of course to you're of course fine to correct me if you want to, but um, sometimes I do realize if I'm saying something incorrectly myself and think, "Wow, I'm really stupid." <laughs> oh, but that's how it is. So it's, it's all good. Uh, let's see. Uh, I noticed during the fight uh, against that stalker that there's still some time to go until Maya can, until Maya's persona is uh, completely maxed out. And when that happens, I could finally get a group heal. Which, yeah, if I had a group heal during these fights, it would have helped me tremendously. Since it's not a very secure thing, you, you, I don't feel very secure if I don't have a group heal during a boss fight. Because uh, regardless of what I say, if this game is hard or not, if it's a challenge for me or not, um, that's under the pretense that I have group heals available um, and such. Me, basically that you're that I am as prepared as I can be um, I mean obviously if you're not prepared you're probably going to die and and that would of course make you feel that uh, this particular section in the game is uh, difficult or challenging and but when I say that, uh, that if a game is hard or not um, 
that's another pretense that I am prepared um, as, as good as I can be with my the resources, my characters, and the skills they have available to them. Which, yeah, what they can use to prevent from being at a disadvantage against um, the bosses or the enemies. Now, could I stop doing shitty damage and maybe get on with it? Yes, that would be nice. Oh man, I, w I wish I could, I, I wish I could uh, do the stat allocation for my, <laughs> for my party members uh, besides Maya, because it just pains me when some of these characters have, when some of these characters have such, uh, such bad SP re regenerative capabilities. I have to be more careful with spells when I use them. Then again. It's, I guess it's all fine if you look at it this way. I mean, yeah, character, people are different and they have different characteristics. And in this case, different stat allocations which are given to them automatically upon... Well, not quite automatically. I mean, yeah, they have some basic... They have these uh, kind of basic static allocations when they level up. But it's also determined... You also get one bonus stat depending on... Um, the persona you have equipped when you level up. I don't know if some people have missed out on that, but uh, it's just a minor detail. Um, but it might be important if you actually are intending to build your character in a certain way. And you, so that way you can somehow, uh, well, a bit, you can affect how they will, how their stats will end up uh, at the end of the game. <laughs> 